Giselle Lauren Lazzarato, born Gregory Allen Lazzarato, and who we all know as Gigi Gorgeous, is definitely one of the biggest celebrity transformations of our day. Gigi's career began with a YouTube channel in 2008, and she's still a YouTube star as well as model, influencer, transgender beauty activist, and more. These days, Gigi has a signature glamorous look, but a lot has taken place for her to get where she is now. YouTube followers first knew Gigi as Gregory, a gay male who was well known for doing makeup tutorials. It wasn't until December 2013 that Gigi announced herself as a transgender woman. Hey guys, it's Gigi and I am feeling red today. And like many other stars, Gigi has been super open about all of the work that she's gotten done leading up to her dream transformation. Using this as an opportunity to educate the public. She's covered her facial plastic surgeries as well as her boob job on her personal YouTube channel. And it's no doubt that she looks amazing. I feel like Jasmine or something with like my in this video, we will break down Gigi's iconic and inspiring evolution from Gregory to Gigi in this series we titled Before and After. My name's Kara, and we've done other transformation videos, including one on Farrah Abraham and the cast of Friends. Let us know who's next in the comments down below. How about her gal pal, Trisha Paytas? Hey, everyone. So starting with cosmetic procedures, obviously Gigi has undergone some intense procedures, ranging from hormone replacement therapy to multiple face surgeries. Taking a look at what work Gigi has gotten done to her face, there's quite a bit. She got a forehead reduction, her chin done, and a nose job. In one of Gigi's videos, she explained that her hairline was lowered, her brow was shaved, she got a mini eyebrow lift, a rhinoplasty, and her chin was shaved down. Was. My hairline was lowered, my brow was shaved, I had a mini eyebrow lift, um, rhinoplasty. Getting all of this done, Gigi talked about how brutal the pain was afterwards. All I remember is just throbbing pain. Like, I thought, I, I felt like someone had shot me in my face. I can't even imagine, it's like your entire face. At the time of these surgeries and this video, Gigi's nose job wasn't too drastic. But these days, her nose appears even smaller. So it looks like she may have gotten it done again. Some websites speculate that she had her eyes fixed as they look much bigger than her earlier days. But this may have been just a result of her brow lift. Gigi's lips are always extra plump as well, which we can thank injections for. She actually started getting them done before her full transition and she posted a video about them in 2013 and I never really thought I would go through with lip injections but it turned out to be like the best thing ever and clearly she's still consistent all that work Gigi has gotten done to her face is also known as facial feminization these surgeries are used to alter more typical male features and make them more feminine to remove the Adam's apple Gigi completed a tracheal shave this is exactly what it sounds like shaving down the trachea or the cartilage in that area which makes up the Adam's apple she explained in a video that they only use local anesthesia for this instead of putting you under which is common, but it still sounds pretty painful to me. Might be too much information, but they burn it when they open it and they burn it when they close it, so you're smelling burning flesh. In order to permanently remove facial hair, Gigi has gone through electrolysis. This is when heat or chemical energy is used to destroy the hair's center of growth. When she got this done, she documented her journey on YouTube, as well as opened up about her struggles. You did so good, then. Sorry, see you. Her facial hair and the process of removing it had been an ongoing insecurity for her. This procedure was painful, leaving redness and scabs all over her face. But that didn't last long and her skin was healed in about a week. Hormone therapy and breast augmentation were also necessary for Gigi to make her transition. According to Wikipedia, the purpose of the hormone therapy is to cause the development of the secondary sex characteristics of the desired sex, such as breasts and a feminine pattern of hair, fat, and muscle distribution. It's a complicated process so we won't get into it but clearly this is required in terms of her breasts Gigi has had them done more than once aside from her initial breast implant surgery in 2014 later on in 2017 she said she had her nipples fixed as well a few different videos can be found on YouTube where she gives details about her boob job journey there is one thing Gigi won't talk about though she stated whenever I'm asked the genital question I like to leave it open-ended because who needs to know that I'm sure many people would like to know but I guess that'll have to be left to the imagination. Moving on to Gigi's hair and makeup. Gigi's look has had some signatures that rarely change, like long bleach blonde hair, big eyelashes, and full lips. Gigi is a natural blonde, but definitely colors her hair to keep it that platinum shade. Hair extensions are responsible for most of the length and volume, as you can see in photos like this, which is likely her hair with no extensions. She's made videos for her audience about the kinds of extensions she uses as well. Either way, the hair always looks great. Although she experiments the odd time, she always seems to come back to her usual blonde. 
Gigi has always had a super bright and white smile, and I would definitely say it's a big part of her look. She got a deal with Crest Canada back in 2015, and I think it was super fitting. Finally, Gigi's makeup. It's rare to see the star with a bare face. After all, makeup tutorials were how she got started on YouTube, and she's definitely skilled at applying it. A couple things that are pretty consistent with Gigi's appearance are long lashes and noticeable lips. False lashes and a good lip color seem to be super important to her look. All considered, Gigi's clearly had one of the most drastic celebrity transformations ever in my opinion. Going from Gregory to Giselle, it's almost shocking how great she looks, but not when you look at all that she's been through. I really don't think there's anything she could do to be more feminine and it's great that she's so open about her transformation. Iconic to say the least. I'm wrapping this video up here. I need you guys to tell me who's next in the comments down below. My name's Kara and as long as you guys keep sending me requests, I'll keep bringing you more before and after videos. Let me know who's next down below and I'll see you in another video. Bye!